Good day, Lords and Ladies. Welcome back to War Tales. Me, Cornish Knight, and the kind of company I was doing, Drawn Batch. And to be honest, I hate it. I hate this region. The fact that they lock you into pretty much an automatic loss fight with the Inquisition just because you can't pass a random like question questionnaire um, is annoying. And then I know people are going to go, oh, but if you know about the religion, it's like, no, like the game's lore isn't isn't given out enough for you to actually remember stuff like what particular branches of the churches do or what's their key characteristics or like of a particular region's church like it doesn't play a big enough role and the fact that they literally block everywhere you go means that I can't even get around the map easily Will you just leave me the hell alone? I'm trying to improve the cure, but with the Inquisition sniffing around, I'm afraid they'll accuse me of... So, okay. Do you feel better? No nausea, dizziness, oozing rashes on the chest? Perfect. My new cure didn't kill you. What a relief. Thank you. I'm nearing my goal. What do you mean, didn't kill me? Okay. Let's get our gear fixed. Make sure to close the door behind you. Those nosy equipment should still last a while. Give me your repair tools. Um, let's see if I can sell some stuff to try and raise a bit of money. Um, what can I sell? We can sell, we can sell that. Um, that. The artifacts I need to go back to the trader to sell. I need to make better armor, really. Um, okay, let's remove that. We can then put where are the runes? So yeah. He's got that on, which would be better than the thing he had previously. Yeah, a lot better. Okay. Uh, yeah. I know is what we're missing. Now, either what it's either that or we start going into like stuff like helmets. Making him a helmet wouldn't be bad because then we could get rid of the stupid um wolf one. No, we do have a 
my good helmet. What am I doing? Okay. Let's remove the stamp because he's got protection. I do like the how I just don't like the stupid like putting an animal like pelt on top of it. I never did like that. Okay. Let's see. Protection, protection, protection. Yeah. Ignore all the negative effects, but he's already immune to that, so... Yeah, protection, damage reduced by 30%. Okay, so he's got that, so he's now a lot more tanky in what they need to do, and it's been locked. He has... It's not... A... I keep it because literally the venomous coating is really useful, but it's probably time that I actually sift out and get him a better helmet, really. And better armor to boot. Um, but I don't have a ton of iron. Okay. Um, and I'm constantly having to figure out ways of sneaking around the Inquisition. Constantly using like crampons and stuff to get about is fine, but at the same time, it's going to not be optimal in the long run. Okay. That's the arena. The thing is, I'd like to try and get some work done so we could actually start earning a bit of money because I'm a bit low on cash. Yeah, because we can take these guys. These is a fight we can handle. The previous one, where it's Inquisitor. Okay. Getting these guys would be straightforward. There is a lot of them, though, so we had to be tactical. Proof up here will be a pain. We have enough forces though, so it's not the end of the world. This batch down here though is not going to be pleasant. Just trying to figure out if I want to use my hammer. Where I want to put him. I mean, it's not a nice fight, this, to be honest, but we can still relatively quickly clean it up. Okay, so who's next? You. No, I've already got to get my Master Backstabber in here. Okay. Let's go.
Okay. Wiped out a good chunk of them. And we've pretty much pacified this quadrant. That's good. You're probably going to go and engage him, which is fine. Okay. Out of him, please. And him, please. Then it's you boys up here. Which is actually going to be painfully easy to do. Just about here for the marker. No, it's not. It's going to be just here. Okay. Ah, oh, well. Sucks for you. Okay. Run up behind him, please. Okay, okay. Next person is you, which, to be honest, is going to be brutally easy to do. Run up to you. Okay. Take you out. Next person is going to be you. I do hope that this is going to be an interesting meeting to be in and not just one where it's just tedium. Because I have found the tedium maps, like the tedium sort of encounters to be really annoying in this game. Him. Okay. Who's next? These ones up here. Thank you, Doki. Let's run up to him. Because one of my like concerns playing this game is that. A lot of times games get around difficulty just by making making the scenario not making the scenarios harder, but just making it just annoying. 
which is how I'm slightly worried that this this bunch of people will turn out like this map will be because it's like the whole oh the Inquisition mechanic it's interesting it's like yeah but it's not that interesting it's just tedious I need to get that fireproofing stuff up. Okay. Okay, let's get... No, we don't need to get that up. Who's next in the turn order? You. Okay. You're probably going to go and charge him. It's you down here. Which can be easily dealt with. Run him through, please. Okay. You're going to come up behind and take care of him. Bit of damage is annoying, but that's how it is. So that side's pacified. Okay. Need to block you. Not the hardest thing to do. Okay. Probably should have sent the wolf in, to be honest. Yeah, sort of sent if he sent the wolf in. Uh, no, we're just gonna kill them. We need to. We need the um, materials they have and stuff on them. Okay. Who's the last person left? You. Uh, we can't do anything about that, unfortunately. Okay. Took some equipment damage, that's fine. So all we have to do is just move up behind you. Get rid of your guard. There we go. Equipment's damage was bad, not going to lie. Anything of interest down this way? There's the fishery. Stop talking to the slaves, you're slowing them down. Stop talking to the slaves, you're slowing them down. Stop talking to the 
Okay, fine, madam. Right, let's just... Do a bit of fishing. Down. Master Angle and fishing, you're always willing a random component with fish. Fantastic. That's done. Human remains. Yeah. So the eye has been here and basically killed everybody. Bridges out. Prince Erald asks us to rebuild this bridge, but someone messed up the order of materials. When the cart got here, it was short several sandstone blocks. Now we need to send word to the castle. Then wait for quarry owners to set their prices, for slaves to carve out the blocks, and for caravans to deliver them. It's going to take weeks. We're willing to buy any sandstone you have. We won't get paid until the bridge is fit. Ugh. This is where I dumped most of my sandstone, isn't it? Unless we put it in the inventory bag. And no. Probably dumped it to save weight, which was stupid on my part. But hey ho. If we can find a mine, we'll be okay. Um, thought I had a fragment of a presser's item in there. Okay. Without the sandstone, though, not what we can do on our side. Right. Okay, knowledge points, fantastic. Bits and pieces, fantastic. Not only am I very capable fighter, but I'm also very capable artisan. Why wouldn't who wouldn't want to marry me? Celebrate. His relationships improved, which is fantastic. Yeah, adores him, which means we all get a bonus. Well, those guys get a bonus for being near him. Does he have a negative trait? I mean, besides that... What's his negative trait? I mean, glutton is not great, but that's a lot of influence we have to lose. Okay. Really? Make sense of this gravestone. Something's not right. There's something written on the gravestone. Scholar compendium required gets the treasure of the ancients. Yeah. Just some reads. Douse who drunk. Douse who drunk salute to you. Well, puzzle to companion spot a small object in the dirt. Must be salute, probably. You found an artifact. 
by the beast's fangs. You must analyze it right away. It could be the key to this mystery. What's going on? Who is... who are we talking to? So, mercenaries, what did you find out about the artifact? Is it a sword? A key? A trinket? Heavy rains revealed this site in the fall. To think we were playing roost over a secret tomb. I can't believe we're about to uncover an unknown site. See, the thing is, I actually side with the scholars in this instance. I don't like the whole, oh, we have to protect the ancients kind of um, line that the game tries to push because they say, oh, it's a good option protecting like the individual culture and heritage and that kind of thing. It's like, yeah, but it's massive folk tradition. Like, this civilization isn't even that old. You're literally just into Pisces camp. brother was abducted when he was just a boy. He must be a grown man now. I don't even know if I'd recognize him. In Gosenberg and Alazar, everyone claims that their slaves are all former criminals. It's a lie. In all of the kingdoms, bandits kidnap peasants and sell them to those barbarians from the north. Curse them all. Are you here to hunt the ghost pack? You got the wrong camp, mercenaries. The tracker set up there is in the center of Drumback. We too come from Harag, but with a different purpose. Despite the many treaties and peace accords between our kingdoms, Alazar keeps buying slaves from the bandits roaming our lands. We were sent by our clan to free our brothers and sisters who were captured by those miscreants. Should you wish to support our cause, we can afford to reward you. Enter the Icy Bay Fishery after nightfall. Free the poor souls they're holding captive and bring them to us. We'll make sure that no soldier interrupts you. I mean, this is why I didn't want to side with these guys, because they go on about how, oh, the other people are traipsing all over their, their sort of independence and stuff, and then they turn around and do exactly the same thing. And then try and claim they're righteous in doing it when the other side was doing exactly the same thing and saying exactly the same things that they were saying. Old Tyrol's Armstead. Father, don't you recognize me? I'm as old. Father, tell them! By saying Eliar, please, Father, it's me, your daughter. I don't know. I can't think straight. What the? What's going on? And in the meantime, we'll get some wood chopping in. Nothing like a bit of wood chopping to clear the head. Okay. I don't know what to do. These three women claim to be my daughter is old, and I can't tell which one is telling the truth. Oh, good folks, I'm so ashamed that I can't even recognize my own daughter. I beg you, take pity on me. I'm but a blind beggar whose beloved child left him long ago. If only, if only you could help me find my Azold. Okay, let's inspect. There's nothing but an old blue dress in this chest. Okay. Inspect. This, fias this fresco is ancient, but, it's fade but it has faded over time. Pigs, by the looks of it. Pig, sheep, and a girl in a blue dress. Inspect. Okay. 
Let's get the hemp. Inspect a dusty axe. Cheese. Okay. Ten years fighting for the Brotherhood. Ten years sending him my wages. And for what? So that this old coot doesn't even recognize me when I come back. Convince him that I'm the real as old mercenaries, and I'll give you my old armor. Okay, what does the child look like in the picture? Dark hair and a blue dress. These wenches are only after what little he has left. Please, mercenaries, you must convince my father that I'm the real Isold. I'll give you what's most precious to me if you make these women leave. I risked my life to provide for my father. I spent ten years in a gang of bandits to put food on the old man's table, and he doesn't even recognize me. I'm willing to give you my weapon to make him come. Okay. Only, if only you could help me find my Azov. Oh, judging by the picture, it's dark hair and a blue dress. Ten years fighting for the Brotherhood. Ten years convince him that I'm the real Azov. Wenches are only at please mercenaries. You must. Uh, the thing is, it looks brown with a blue dress. Let's try brown hair. If only, if only you could help me find my Azov. Let's go with identify the dark head sold as the shepherd's daughter. You're not as stupid as you look, mercenaries. But you would have been better served to get it wrong. Then we wouldn't have to slaughter you. The sheepfold is ours. Get back. That's a lot. Uh, can I save? No. Okay, we're going to have to fight this. Right. Okay. A lot of criminals. Let's go. Hey lords and ladies, um, sorry for this abrupt end to the episode, um, but as we went into the fight the game crashed. Unfortunately I was able to cover most of the footage, but it crashed us as we were loading into the fight. So it's going to basically pick up from where the autosave kicks in. Because um, I've tried going back to an earlier save, but it won't allow it. So next episode, we'll basically kick off where the fight is. And I shall see you all again next time. Good. Bye.